Yeah, Chad Miller, C H A D M I L L E R. Uh, Director of Contract Manufacturing for American National Manufacturing Incorporated. So, can you tell me where we are today? What's going on? Yeah, today we're at the Manufacturers Council of the Indian Empire here at the Riverside Convention Center, um, and we are here uh, as a as an association that's uh, sharing. Uh, both information and uh, our products and services and things that we manufacture and, and talking about the state of manufacturing in the state of California and nationally. Uh, why do you feel events like this are so important to the manufacturing community? Uh, events like this are so important because if we're behind our desks and we're just stuck in our manufacturing boxes, there's a lot of information and there's a lot of things that that are out there that we need to know, whether it's regulatory issues, whether it's labor law issues, um, networking with other companies that are here, uh, maybe finding other suppliers or services that you need as a manufacturer. Um, there's also a lot of information on how to do things better. And every manufacturer would agree that can we do things smarter and faster, um, more efficiently with better quality, we should, we should be pursuing that. And this is a place where you can do that. Chad, um, what do you feel are the most pressing, in your opinion, issues facing the manufacturing community today, like imports, regulations? Well, it's hard to say what the number one pressing issue is. There's so many, but the top three, I think, would be regulatory uh, um, items, uh, regulatory uh, requirements. Uh, second would be workforce, uh, talented, educated workforce, um, like we talked about today, with great character that we can train for a skill or a trade. Um, and then lastly, of course, the cost of doing business in California is always a struggle. So finding, again, like I mentioned earlier, how to do things better, faster, is always important for manufacturers. Are you from local? Corona, yes. Okay. So what do you feel, uh, what impact do the manufacturing and manufacturing jobs have on the local economy? I once heard a number that for every manufacturing uh, dollar is spent, it's, it's seven times that number, so seven dollars impact on the local economy. So manufacturers, you know, we buy other raw materials, we support transportation, we're trucking goods back and forth, we are buying utilities, you know, we are uh, on the roads with our sales guys, we've got manufacturing people and everyone, that, all the infrastructure required to have a manufacturing company really impacts it seven times. Well, basically, I just want to ask you, if, um, Chad, if someone watching this and thinking about coming next year, what would you tell about a manufacturer like yourself? Uh, as a manufacturer, I mean, I suggest you being here. It, it was important enough for me to be here these last three years, and I would highly recommend it. You're going to get some information that's going to help you when you're looking at a global market and competing with other states to be in California and be manufacturing. There's a wealth of information and partnerships within the Inland Empire. And the MCIE is an excellent way to get connected to um, all these other manufacturers. There's a lot going on in the Inland Empire. We are a really manufacturing mecca. Um, and to come in and meet people and, and network and, and learn and, and take some of the information here and apply it back at, at your operation, it will always result in an improvement of some sort. I can guarantee that. Excellent. Just last question. What is your feeling on the future of manufacturing in the area? Is it your forecast? Well, ourselves, we continue to expand. Um, I, I just uh, purchased a building in the Riverside area, um, so we're expanding our operations. And right now, my uh, the reshoring efforts going on right now into the U.S. Is, is substantial. So we actually get more requests for quotes than we actually have time to even work on projects. So I'm very excited about what's going on currently um, with, with a bit of luck and some hard work and, and, some, and some great decisions with our government and our manufacturing uh, industry. We'll continue to see growth in that area. Um, we're excited about, like I said, what's, what's to come. Um, and it's important for us manufacturers to be connected with our regulators um, and the people that impact our, our doing business here. They need to know what, what they're doing and how it impacts us, um, both negatively and positively. Yeah, perfect. Great job. Thank you so much for your time. Sure.